sucking, sea life, and death. What do they all have in common? Straws. Straws. It's ladylike, and this week, we're gonna stop sucking. This week, we're banning single-use plastic straws. Oh, that looks like it hurt. And that's blood? Yeah, it's just little turtle blood. I could not watch the straw being pulled out of the turtle's nose. I've seen that video on Twitter. It's so real and cringy. And it freaks me the hell out. Oh my gosh. Look at this little pouch. This is adorable. Oh, this is a hefty straw. <gasps> It says ladylike. My straw says Freddie's goddamn straw, which is amazing. Wow. Mm. Okay. Feels very, feels very thick in my mouth. Oh. I am a little worried because I lose things. In my brain space, I only have room for remembering my keys, my wallet, and the rest of my purse. So I'm just gonna have to throw this baby in my purse and like always remember it. Okay, so we're going to Vegas this weekend for a shoot. We're working all weekend. With the rest of Ladylike. We have to remember to tell any servers at bars or restaurants, no straws. No ma'am, not today, Satan. But if we accidentally use or receive any straws, we have to keep them with us for a week. At the end of the week, whoever has the least amount of plastic straws wins. May the most eco-friendly, ladylike person win. Win. So I put my iced coffee in this glass bottle with my glass reusable straws. Oh wow. Ain't it cute? You're doing it. How are you doing with your, yep, I see no straw. No straw. I see a reusable mug. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Oh, metal straw, just Ooh. saying. Wait a minute. Plastic wow. cup. Wait a minute. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> So I'm a little bit nervous. We have a lot of parties coming up. That's a lot of drinking, a lot of cocktails, straws. I was confident, but now I'm like, this is gonna be hard. In the airport, I used one plastic straw. So I couldn't find this earlier on the airplane, and so I ended up using a plastic straw. So I do have one straw that I have collected, and it's only day two. But now I'm using this for my cocktail. We went to a magic mic show. I think we did pretty well. We were straw free. Mm -hmm. Strawless and braless. Ooh. Mm -hmm. I thought about that. Oh. Yay! Yay! We had champagne and then the cocktail lounge. At this bar in Vegas, the straw is actually built into the glass. That's ingenious. That's some good glass blowing. What do you think, Chantel? I love it. I love it. <laughs> We went to a very nice restaurant for Kristen's birthday, and that evening, also, there were zero straws involved. But we went to the pool. That's where they get you. Because you can't have glass by the pool. Yep. We definitely got a plastic straw out of that. I used another plastic straw, so we were one for two. Day after Vegas, I had a really hard time keeping up with my straws while in Vegas. I did forget to bring my glass straw at certain points, but what I did do was just made sure that I just drank from the glass when I needed to. After Vegas, we came back home with my pretty little Cinderella straw. I call it a Cinderella straw because it's made out of glass. As close as I am gonna get to being a Disney princess. <laughs> Should I like lose mine at midnight? See if a man comes. See if a man picks it up. I mean, my name's Vegas. on it. Yeah. <laughs> when I cook at home, I kind of drink out of mason jars. But I have a sneaking suspicion that it's gonna creep up on me and I'm just gonna receive a straw at like Starbucks or something. So I did just leave dinner. I of course forgot my glass straw at home, but I made sure to not get a straw when we ate. I ordered a beer and it came poured into a glass, no straw. So I'm really trying to definitely make a way around when I forget my glass straw at home and to make sure I'm still being safe to the environment. I just ordered myself an iced coffee. These young gentlemen handed me straw, I almost tore it open fully, but then I remembered. Sir, I don't need this straw, thank you. I have my own. Yay. Taking the straw pledge, one straw at a time. Mm. Drinking at home, I didn't use any straws, did you? Agreed. What's this from? Oh. <laughs> So after Vegas, we had two days, like you said, at home. And it legit, that was our weekend because we were working through the weekend. 
So what do I order when I'm feeling like I really deserve a treat? Boba. So I just ordered boba on Postmates and I forgot to put in the instructions, no straw. It just slips my mind so much until after the fact. Hi. Hello. Can I ask you to keep the straw yeah. that comes with it? He handed me the bag and looked at it and I was like, oh, wait, 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 wait. I need the straw, I need the straw. Actually, wait, sorry, I'm gonna keep the straw, sorry. I tried y'all. What do you need with boba? This fat straw for boba tea. So after our two days at home, Fred and I had to go to Anaheim, which was this big convention called VidCon. This is what ruined us. It's a lot of panels and meet and greets and parties. You know, you go to a bar and you get those little tiny cocktail straws. You get like four or five drinks. Then that's like at least four to 10 straws. That's true. So that's just one night. Well, this is the thing though. I feel like you drink a lot of like rose and wine and stuff, which doesn't require a straw. True. And I love a good beer. Okay, so we're just gonna stick to beer and wine. We'll stick to beer and wine. And this will be healthier for our bodies anyone. Anyway. Yeah. So my first big kind drink was at the full screen lounge and I had a white Russian with no shame with my drink and straw in hand. I was like, oh, hello, straw challenge what? So I'm at four at this point. At my first VidCon YouTube party, I had three cocktail straws. So that brings my number up to five. So you're actually ahead of me now. No, oh my God, how did that happen? I think I had two drinks at the Raznad party. Both of them had straws. I had six. I switched to white wine at that party. So I'm at five or six. That night, I think I would have been saved had I just gone home. Gone home, gone home. So I went to the hotel bar and I had two there. So that brings my number up to eight straws. We kind of suck. Yeah. Gone home. I didn't take any pictures, but I know I had three bourbon smashes. It's eight. Alcohol that's killing our sea life. Poison to us and poison to the sea life. Right. So I went to Palm Springs. After I left VidCon, I had a watermelon margarita with a straw, so that brings me up to nine. I just went to Starbucks with Jared and I was having a conversation about boys and I forgot to ask to not have a straw. And I already took a sip. I predicted this. Receive a straw at like Starbucks or something. So that brings me up to nine. Wow, we're tied. We actually sip. I have been humbled by the straws. I need to be more aware that when I'm drinking in general, even if it's a glass of water or a cocktail, I need to say no straw, please. That's something that needs to just become a part of my vernacular. Otherwise, I will forget and be like, oh, it's not my fault. When really, the onus is on me to, to make a difference and to make a change. It was very nice when MGM made a conscious effort to not give us straws. It helped us in this challenge, even though they had no idea we were doing this challenge. Mm -hmm. It's really nice when corporations and cities and states do this thinking so that the consumer doesn't have to. Simply Straws did not sponsor us. This is just something super important that we wanted to try for ourselves. So even though we tried the straw challenge and we still kind of sucked, changing habits takes a long time. We're gonna sign the pledge and efforts to do better after this, and we hope that you do too. The first 2,000 people to sign the pledge will get a free glass straw from Simply Straws. If 2,000 people commit to this challenge, we're saving the ocean from 60 million straws, and that's a big deal. I want to gift you with this glass straw and pass on the challenge. Oh, great. So we can save the environment. Thank you. I'll use it for my PBR. <gasps> yes. <laughs> Not sucking for a week. Lady tested. Lady, Lady sucked, sucked a, a little, little less. less. But we're working hard to not suck as much. Or at all. Hey, Unsolved is on a new channel. And now your part. Subscribe, Subscribe here. here. That was my part.